それでは早速ですね本日のゲストにご登壇いただきたいと思いますこの世界のさらにいくつもの片隅にの監督片渕素直さんですそれでは大きな拍手でお迎えくださいそれでは、えー、一言まずご挨拶をお願いします。So, I would like to ask、uh, Director Katabuchi to say a few words. はい、あの今ご覧いただいたこの世界のさらにいくつもの片隅にの監督の片渕です。今日はよろしくお願いします。Yes,、uh, my name is、uh, Katabuchi and I directed、uh, the movie,、uh, the film that you just saw in this corner and other corners of the world. では早速お話を伺っていこうかなと思うんですが今回、えー、海外映画祭と監督というカテゴリーで、えー、監督にお越しいただいたわけですけれどこの、えー、さらにいくつもの片隅にの前というかに2016年に作ったこの世界の片隅にの方で監督は、えー、あの詩国際アニメーション映画祭ほえ出られて、えー、受賞されているわけですけれど、その時のまあ印象などを聞かせてください。Yes, so、uh, I believe so.、Uh, you know, we're going to be talking in this category about、uh, the、uh, international film festivals and、uh, directors of films. And、uh, I believe that the film before the film that we saw today, the one back in 2016, won the、uh, Annecy Awards. And I would like to ask the director,、uh, you know, how That was received. Any any kinds of strong impressions he he's felt from the awards? あの確かあの時では一番最初のオープニングに近い位置での上映だったんですね。でそれで一番最後にその審査されるまでの間にあの場所を借りてそのうんこういう映画はなぜどういうふうにそのあのリサーチして作ったかっていうトークはやったんですけど。間ずっとあの会場にいなかったんです。<笑> And、uh, actually, you know, the film、uh, in this corner of the world was、um, kind of like it, it was at the Annecy. It was, it was screened quite close to the uh, opening uh, film. And、uh, so, which happened at the、uh, really like first half of the、uh, awards. And then、uh, during the awards, you know, whilst the, the, ju the、uh, jury was going on,、uh, uh, you know, we had、uh, been, you know, Talking, having a talk show with other people about、uh, you know, how you know, we, we conducted research in order to create this film、uh, in another venue. So、uh, it was quite a long time until we got the, the results. So, what were you doing、uh, after the, your screening and up until the、uh, award was、uh, announced? I was in Japan, and I was in Japan, and I was in Japan, and I was in Japan. であの可能な限りホテルでそれを読んでたんですね。あとは一回だけ牧場に行って牛を眺めました。<笑> Um, actually, you know,、uh, you know, I brought、uh, suitcases、uh, from Japan、uh, full of books on the Heian era in Japan, and、uh, I was reading those books one by one. And I also went to visit a farm, and I was、uh, just staring at the cows. <laughs> ではその本が何につながったか後で伺うとしてあのレクチャーをされたという話がありましたけれど、まあ、題材としてはすごくドメスティックな日本の、まあ、戦時中の生活を描くというものだったわけですけれどやはりせんあのヨーロッパのあのシーのお客さんにもそういうものは伝わるという実感みたいなのはレクチャーなどを通じてありましたか。So yes, we can talk about the connection with those books later. So、uh, yes, you just mentioned、uh, you know that you were doing like talk sessions and lectures you know at the awards, and I'm just wondering like、uh, you know、uh, because the film、uh, in this corner of the world features、uh, you know a very domestic lifestyle in Japan during the war, and I'm wondering how that was received. Received、uh, in Europe, like was it really communicated well? あの例えばその千九百四十四十年代のあの毎日の生活を描いているんですけど、その毎日の中でえっ、ー、と一日一日はどんな例えばお天気だったか、何があの他にあったかなんていうこととかを
あのど,ういうどんなふうに調べたかみたいなのを話しました。Yes, I spoke about、uh, in those lectures. I spoke about、uh, what went on during the 1940s, like what kind of、uh, daily lives did people、uh, have, and like, for example, what was the weather like each day, what kind of、uh, episodes happened you know, during those times. In the movie, there were many things that happened in the movie, but in the movie, there were many t h i n g 雨の下に立たせたりとか、ちょっとなんかそのことがまた新しい演出につながっていったりしたわけですね。実際のあのお天気、実際にその日の雲がどんな形をしていたか、そういうことを調べたっていうの話をしてます。Yes,、uh, the original、uh, comic、uh, shows a lot of days that were sunny. But you know, when we did some research, we found out that there were some rainy days. So, so what we did was、uh, we did depict some rainy days in the film, and、um, we uh, pur- purposely uh, had the、uh, characters stand in the rain without an umbrella. Uh, which you know, just became a new essence of dramatization. And we also、uh, did some research on clouds in, in those days, like you know, what kind of shapes those clouds were. So, I was a little bit of 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 a l i t t 絵に描けるしどんなあの雲の形でも描けるっていうのをそのなんか渡辺さんがそういうふうにその大島渚組の時の話をされていてその中からこうなんかこう突然悟ったようにアニメーションの特徴っていうのを語られたことがあってあでそれだったらばどんな天気でも描けるんならば実際に起こった天気を描けるんだなっていうふうに思ったわけですね。So, uh... You know, uh, back in those days,、um, I was talking to、uh, actor、uh, Fumio Watanabe, and、uh, we were talking about the days when he was in the、uh, Oshima Nagisa Gumi or group. And、uh, when we were talking about、uh, animation,、um, he said, Oh, you know, we don't need weather days、uh, for animation because you know, we can depict. Those weathers on your own. And so, which meant that, you know, it didn't matter, you know,、uh, what the weather was. And so I thought, okay, well, then if it didn't really matter, why,、uh, why don't I really look into what the weather was and then just depict what kind of weather I wanted to depict? So, I think, I'm going to go to the next one. 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 作品ということができると思うんですが、こちらをこう改めて作ろうと思った理由というのはどういう理由だったんでしょうか。So I believe you know the first film in this corner of the world that was released in 2016, and for the film for today,、uh, I believe you added new scenes and elaborated on the theme.、Uh, I like to ask you why you decided to create this film. あのまあ原作河野文雄さんの漫画なんですけど、河野さんはその主人公は鈴さんじゃないんだ。戦争なんだっておっしゃってたりもするんですね。で、この世界の片隅に2016年の映画はもうはっきりそのスズさんっていうそのある種の狂言回しの目を通して戦争っていうものがどんなふうに推移していったのかっていうものを映画にしようと思いました。So,、um, uh, Fumio Kono, who's actually the creator of the original manga、uh, in, in the corners、uh, of this world,、um, she said that、uh, actually you know,、uh, Suzu is not the protagonist of the,、uh, co- of the original comic. That she says that it's actually the war is the protagonist. And so,、um, in the 2016 film,、uh, you know, we depicted Suzu so that. She is the protagonist in showing how the war had progressed. あのところが河野さんは実際にはねまた違う要素も入れてらっしゃってそれはその当時の,その女性が自分の,そのまあ自分の恋愛,でも恋愛対象でもない人と結婚するして生活して妻になり主婦になっていくっていうことのなんかそのことをこう。あの書かれそのことも書かれてるわけですね。えっ、ー、とその中ではあのその主人公のスズさんはその絵を描く才能に恵まれてるんだけども主婦になったら絵を描くことを封印するなんていうことも含まれていたわけです。
So uh, also uh, the uh, Kono Fumio, uh, Fumio Kono, she uh, mentioned that uh, there were also different elements that she depicted in the original manga. She said that you know the women, uh, Japanese women of those days, you know they uh, weren't free to marry who they really liked. They, they you know uh, they had to go through like an arranged marriage, and they have to get, get married to somebody they hardly knew, and then they would have to become a, a wife, and then, then become a housewife, and uh, live their lives with uh, their husbands. And um, and in the film, you know, Suzu was, uh, you know, she's really good at drawings. But uh, you know, when she got married, she stopped these drawings. あの、で、自分の魂も奪われて閉じ込められ、でもそこからあの自分自身で脱出していくっていう話だったんですね。so uh, and then uh, the character uh, you know reminds me of um, a, a Princess Arite. Princess Arite is a film that I had created before. Um, you know Princess Arite. You know she's a princess and she's a girl, and uh, her name and also her spirit is taken away from her, and she gets uh, imprisoned. But you know she escapes. あの裏の鈴も結婚すると。違う名前になってしまうわけですね。宝城です。宝城になるんですけど、宝城になった途端に彼女は書けないんですよ。それが鈴は書けるけど、名字がその葉書に書こうと思っても書けない。so uh, the same thing actually happens to Suzu Urano because uh, she, you know, she gets married and then her name becomes Hojo from Urano. So her name changes, uh, and then, um, and then when her name changes, she couldn't write her new name. Like she was, like she was struggling to write the postcard. なんかその名前を奪われるっていうところにあのそのまあその女性の立場をどう描くかみたいなことでそのアリテ姫とすごく共通している要素をそのコノさんの漫画の中にも感じていたわけですね。and uh, so the writer, uh, Kono-san, she also felt that there was a commonality with uh, Princess Arite because uh, Suzu, you know, her name, her original name gets taken away. So, uh, so Kono-san, she depicted women, uh, their names getting taken away. And how do we depict these kinds of women? So uh, the point is that uh, there were two themes um, that we wanted to depict. And so uh, two, two themes equals two films. So in my mind, they, they were completely two different films. つまり一つ目はま戦争であるというあの戦争が主人公であるともう一つの方はむしろ様々な女性の生きている様子を拾っていくものだ。というような理解でよろしいですかね。Is it okay for me to understand that the first film, the protagonist is is war, the second film, uh, you depicted women in those days? まあ、あの、本当にその通りですね。あの、もちろん両方の要素があの、最初の映画にも入ってはいるんですけども、特にその部分を拡大していったのがその今ご覧いただいたさらにいくつもの片隅にの方だったわけです。Yes, that's correct. Um, actually, in the first film, we do depict the two elements, but I think that we've expanded more on uh, in the corner, uh, in this corner of the world, um, and, and uh, in, in this new film. So, let's.次回作のつるばみろの何子たちについてえっと伺っていきたいと思うんですが、それではですねまずはこちらの映像をご覧いただきたいかなと。so I would like you to tell us about your a new film, next film, The Morning Children, Nagiko and the Girls Wearing Tsurubami Black, and we're going to be showing you a pilot that will last for about three minutes.
、えー、大変見応えのあるパイロットフィルムでしたがあの改めてこの「鶴ばみ色の凪子たち」という映画、まあ、どこがスタート地点で、えーどんなところを目指しているのか教えていただけますか。Yes,、uh, it looks like a very substantial、uh, film. You know, seeing this pilot film.、Uh, my question to you is: so, with this new film, like, where are we starting from, and where are we going to? あのこれはあの先ほど申し上げたその2017年のあの市国際アニメーション映画祭の時にえっと。まあ、それまで温め,温めていたそのモチーフが映画になるかどうかをこうあの確かめたわけですねでそれをこうまあ出発点にしてえと作り始めたわけです。So,、uh, I mentioned before about、uh, the, how I spent my days at the Annecy Awards in 2017. And at the time, you know, I was、uh, trying to work out、um, this motif that you just saw. And、uh, so, the starting point was、uh, figuring out whether that would become a movie or not. So, this is the beginning of the pandemic. I'm going to go to the pandemic. あの今コロナなんですけどもそのコロナが流行ってるその流行る前に2017年にあのこういうことが実はその平安時代の枕の草子や紫式部の,その源氏物語が書かれた時代にはあったっていうことを分かってこれを映画にしようと思ったわけですね。So,、um, yeah, so this is、uh, about the plague, you know,、um, and you know, we had the、uh, COVID, you know, we, we had the pandemic. And actually, I started working on this idea before the pandemic. And at the time, you know, I was doing a lot of research on the Heian era, and、um, that was when this book,、uh, literature called the Pillow Book, was、uh, written. And that was this, almost the same time as when the、uh, story of Genji was written, too. それと同時にそのこの世界の片隅にというのがその我々は実際に体験していないその七十数年前の戦争中の時代にあたかも自分たちもそこへ行ったかのように体験するし,するしたような気持ちになれるような映画としてまあタイムマシンのような映画としてあの作ろうと思いある意味であのそれは実現されたと思ったわけなんですが。So,、uh, you know, with this,、uh, in this corner of the world, you know, we're depicting、uh, the war and、uh, how, you know, how people lived, you know,、uh, about more than 70 years ago. And when you saw that film, it, it made you feel like you were there. And it was kind of like a film that was like a, a time machine.、Mm-hmm. And I think, I, you know, we were able to, you know, make that happen in that film. ちょうど千年ぐらい前の時代を描きたいっていうところにつながっていったわけです。And then I was thinking, so how far can this time machine, the same time machine, go? And I was thinking maybe you know, it might be really interesting if it went back to 1,000 years ago. あの同じように千年前のそれぞれの日のお天気はどうだったのかっていう調べるところから始めてるわけですね。And you know, for this new film, you know, I'm also trying to do some research on how the weather was like a thousand years ago. あのパイロットを拝見するとそういう何て言うんでしょうね記録的事実というか、えー、確認できる事実を積み上げつつもあのこの世界よりもより広く、まあ、命が循環していてその中に生と死が含まれていてそれは蚊が、まあ、人間の血を吸うとか魚の餌になるから、えー、人間が死ぬことも含めてあるいは生まれることも含めて。えー、宇宙の設備みたいなところまで風呂敷が広がっているのかなと思ったんですがどうなんでしょうかそのあたりはまだ言うタイミングではないのかもしれませんが。I know that this may not be the right timing to, to maybe answer this question, but、uh, from the、uh, pilot, I can understand that you have you know, done a lot of research on a lot of the、uh, you know, recorded facts in those days. So, what I, so the feeling I, I get is that you're expanding more than in the corners of, this, of the world. I think you know, you're expanding out to this,、uh, this theme of you know, life and death, you know, and that going around and around in a circle. So, You know, mosquitoes, you know, fish would eat mosquitoes, human would eat you know, fish. So it's kind of like one cycle. Um, 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 um,
最後にそのしかしあの別の形で子供を得てしまうっていうお話だったわけですね。あのどこかでは共通していると思います。So, in this corner of the world, I think we saw Suzu. You know, she's a young wife with no children, but you know, in the end, she does get, yeah, she does get a child through a different you know, method. So, I think there may be some commonalities there. I believe that you know, whatever film that I create really teaches me a lot of things, and then as a result, it, you know, it creates a lot of impact. And so that led to、uh, the morning children, Nagiko, and the girls wearing Tsurubami black. ありがとうございました。それではですね、あの次回作を待ちわびる、えー、皆さんに最後一言だけメッセージをいただいて締めくくりにしたいと思います。Yes, thank you very much. So,、uh, yes, the final uh, uh, question is, may I ask you to give a message to the audience who are waiting for this new film? あのこの映画はその単に映画を作るだけではなくて、その映画を作るためのアニメーションのスタッフをあの育て上げながら、あの彼らにその新しいその次の世代をのそのアニメーションを担う力あるいはこの映画を作る力をこう養ってもらいながら作っています。So、uh, for this new film, you know, I wasn't just going to create a film. I also,、uh, you know, my other mission was to、uh, try and nurture、uh, animation staff so that, you know, they would become the, the future animators and they would、uh, be creating a new generation of animators. あのそういう意味では、えっ、ー、とまあ。僕もそのこの映画のためにはもちろん力を尽くすんですけども、新しいそのスタッフたちのえっと働きにも期待していただければと思います。So, uh, so my message is, of course, you know, I'll do my best、uh, for this new film, but I also hope that you'll look forward to the efforts of my new staff. あの今ご覧いただいたパイロットフィルムでもその全く新人の彼らがあの原画を描いたり、かなりかあのたくさんのことをこなしてくれています。And the pilot you just saw、uh, you know, features a lot of、uh, original sketches that these new animators had drawn for me. Yes, I'm sorry, but we need to come to a close now.